10 feet inside the boat and out of the water at all times. Adults, please supervise your children and your inner child as well. In order for us to enter the story of the planet, we need to go to the jaws of Monstro the Whale. Monstro the Whale, as well as Pinocchio and Geppetto, but do not worry, Pinocchio is a smart boy. When he was inside Monstro's belly, he lit a fire. That fire caused Monstro to sneeze. He sneezed so hard, he blew his tail right off, giving us our own special entrance into the story of the planet. On our left hand side we have the cave of the big bad wolf and right across the way we have the homes of the three little pigs. One made of straw, one made of sticks, and one made of 100% wolf proof bricks. the small English village where Alice from Alice in Wonderland is from. She also likes to dig her by the river, but one day she followed a white rabbit and they both fell down, down, down into Wonderland. On our right hand side we have London Park. With the help of Peter Pan, Tinker Bell, and the Pixie Dust, John, Michael, and Wendy flew right up and over into Neverland where they never ever had to grow up. Straight ahead, we have the city of Agrabah, the city of mystery and enchantment. High up top is the Sultan's Palace, and down below is the busy, busy marketplace where Aladdin not only stole bread and apples, but Princess Jasmine's heart as well. Above these rose-filled arches is where Aladdin took Princess Jasmine on her very first magic carpet ride into a whole new world. Now please remain seated and do not touch anything for we are about to enter the Cave of Wonders where everything is enchanted. As Aladdin found out, there is one treasure more precious than the rest. Yeah, no it is that magic lamp containing its very own genie. <laughs> On our right hand side, we have a cottage where Snow White lives with the seven dwarves. Nestled back in those trees is a jewel mine of the dwarves with so one worth away today. To our left, we have the French Chateau, where Cinderella grew up with her wicked stepmother and two evil stepsisters. On that winding path there, you can still see the pumpkin carriage she took all the way up top to meet her Prince Charming at the ball. world's most unusual flower displays. It is a very own giant patchwork quilt made of 23 different desert flowers. All of the plants in Storybook Land are 100% real, just miniaturized by a process known only to our head gardener, Deacre Bell. <laughs> Coming up ahead on our left hand side on that tree stump by the river is the modest home of Mr. Mole. And right next door in that stately manor is home of his not so modest best friend, Mr. Toad. To our left we have the three Dutch mills. The one in the middle is the one that housed all those animals in the harsh winter storm. And the silly symphony is the old mill. Straight ahead underneath those snowy mountains is the alpine village where Pinocchio is from. That wood carving shop by the river is where Geppetto made his first wish upon a star and turned Pinocchio into a real boy. Coming up ahead on our right hand side, stopped in that bay is Prince Eric's ship. The sandy beach 
region that where Ariel took her first steps on land, and they both lived together in that combo today. Please remain completely seated, keeping all hands, arms, and fingers inside the boat.